Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my React.js course. In this video, we will see about little bit further about the forwarding ref. How we can forward the refs from higher order components to the child component. That means, for example, here we have seen this is the this is our forward ref but button component, right? And this is a component which is having a parent of parent forwarding ref. This is the parent. From this parent, we are calling the forward ref button. I already told you that this forwarding ref will be useful that we can pass it through children children like that we can pass it this ref. So for example, here this forwarding ref button, let's assume that this is having a higher order component. So that means the we are calling this forward ref button component. First the higher order component will be called. Inside that higher order component you will be having a wrapper component which calls further the forwarding ref component. So that means inside the child child we are having so how we can pass the forwarding ref from the higher order component let's try to see in this video i am creating a new file that is with forwarding ref dot js this is a higher order component why because i have created with the prefix of with so you can understand so now here with the forwarding ref forwarding ref i am creating export function so as it is in higher order component this one will be a function so with forwarding ref so this one will take take the component wrapped component okay and here what i will try to do so here we'll be having a method and here i'm mentioning the class class with forwarding okay with forwarding so whatever the name you want you can keep or otherwise forwarding ref i am keeping so extends component and here you will be having a constructor of props and this one will be of super of props okay let's keep it like this and you will be having a render method and in this render method you need to return due sorry due okay inside this due what i will try to do i will try to call this wrapper component okay so this wrapper component what it will try to do it will try to call the it will try to call this one so here we need to call something like with forward okay with forward ref so i am calling this entire component wrapper component inside this one so now what will happen so in the parent forwarding ref what we are doing we are calling the forward ref button so that means we are calling this component this component is wrapped inside a higher order component so that means before calling this component higher order, higher order component will be passed so that means through the higher order component i need to pass the refs since this button ref and all those things i need to pass it so how can i pass it let's try to see okay i need to pass the ref and the props so how can we pass it through with forwarding ref as this one is a wrapper component so somehow i need to add a ref for this one which could be passed from the parent forwarding ref so here i am passing this button ref right i need to somehow add it here so how can i add here so what we need to do is so here we are having a function okay this is a function wrapper function inside this function we are having this class so what we can do we need to return the component here so how we can re return return react so here you will be importing the react same concept so we will be using the react dot forward ref okay so this one will take the props sorry this one will take this one will give the props and the ref so this is the anonymous method okay so this is an anonymous method so what is happened yeah so this is an anonymous method inside this anonymous method what i need to do i need to return the what i need to return so this this component i need to return so i need to return this component okay so i need to return this component whatever the component we are having here i need it so now i need to keep the ref here so that it passes the ref okay oh no not ref here button ref or something like this so button ref i need to i need to pass the ref into this button ref now what i can keep so you, another props and all those things whatever the props you are having you can keep the props here okay so now you are having a button ref so i can access this button ref here directly so how can i access so here ref is equal to this dot props dot button ref okay i am passing that ref to the button ref i am passing the ref to the button ref here 
so now what is happening here <coughs> so we are we, whatever the props we are getting it from the parent we am getting it through the forward ref method and this ref method i am passing it to a prop and this props i am passing and this props whatever the ref i am having here i am passing it to the ref so that this wrapper component so same scenario how we are having this one we are having a <coughs> ref here okay so now let's try to see the output if we try to see the output okay with forwarding ref and here we will be see we'll be seeing higher hoc okay hoc for forwarding ref let's try to keep something like this so now if i try to see the output here has been occurred an error let's try to see the output console what is the error parent forwarding ref uh, they occurred in the what is this rendering uh, let's try to see again so let's close this one okay i will refresh it again yeah so no without any problem we got it we got this one so here you will be able to see that hoc for forwarding ref and this forwarding ref component is coming from the higher order component now if you try to see here we are able to change the lila web do also so that means automatically it is changing so here if you try to see here i am able to get the ref text input okay so not this one sorry so we have int console.log i think parent ref component it mounted here we are able to okay okay we have we have it mounted right so we have it did the console.log so here this dot button ref okay <coughs> so now if i try to refresh this one so if i try to refresh so here you will be able to get the object so here we are able to get the object of the child component that is present inside the child from the child okay so in two in deeper inner chains it is having so with forwarding ref is a higher order component and inside this forwarding ref button it is present inside the with forwarding ref okay so this is how we can forward the ref to internal internal children like this okay so now you understood right with the forwarding ref how it will be working and callback reference how it will be working you need to able to understand little bit of confusing will be there between the refs and the forwarding refs but ultimately the logic is somewhat uh, similar only passing the ref to the child components in order to access the child's dom element okay we will be using rarely this type of scenarios this type of advanced scenarios will be using rarely but you need to understand the difference thing so how to use this forwarding ref for the higher order components if you are using higher order component means how to forward the ref to the child component so that we can access the dom html element in the parent component and also inside inside like this uh, child components if you are having how we can use this forward ref okay if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you are coming first time to my channel here please do support me by subscribing to my channel so that i will be posting more and more front end development courses thank you